Hey everybody, this is Rocky. I'm here with my friends from BabeDiets.com and today we're making a salad niçoise. This is probably one of my favorite salads to order when I see it on a restaurant menu because it's, it's light, it's fresh, but yet it's still satisfying and filling enough that you're not going to feel hungry after you've eaten it. So let's get started. The first thing you want to do is boil a pot of hot water so we can blanch our green beans. While we're waiting for our water to boil, we're going to start on the vinaigrette for the salad. So I have some Dijon mustard right here that I'm going to put into my measuring cup. I'm going to add some lemon juice. Some cracked black pepper. A little bit of basil. Some thyme. A couple of pinches of oregano. Okay, we're going to thin this out a little bit with some olive oil, but first I'm going to mix it together to see what we have. Just look at the consistency. Okay. The consistency is nice and thin, but I want to add a little bit of olive oil just to add some body and a little bit of, of uh, the, the olive oil flavor. So I have some olive oil right here. I'm just going to drizzle some in. That is our dressing. I'm just going to set this aside and assemble our salad. So our water is boiling. What I'm going to go ahead and do is put in some fresh green beans. And we're going to blanch these guys. And what that means, we're just going to let them sit in the boiling water for about three minutes. And then once three minutes is up, we're going to go ahead and shoot them down with some cold water. So in my bowl, I have uh, some romaine that I've sliced up. And I'm about to add uh, some little cherry tomatoes, just a few of them. I have a couple of hard boiled eggs right here that I'm just going to cut into quarters and toss in my bowl. I'm going to drop in some sliced black olives. Traditional salad niçoise has boiled potatoes in it, just chopped up boiled potatoes. What I'm going to do is put in some chickpeas so I can uh, add a little, bit a little bit more fiber and protein to my salad. Now I'm adding in, in these beautiful green beans that I blanched. And we just want to cook them for about three minutes and then shoot them down with, you can either shoot them down with cold water or you can put them in an ice bath. Basically what you want to do is just stop the cooking process. You still have that beautiful green color. Um, they have a little bit of tenderness, but they have a little bit of bite as well. Okay, now we're going to add our dressing. So we're just going to drizzle this across the top. Beautiful. And just combine this together. We're going to get this onto our plates and then I'll put the tuna down. And here we go. Here's our salad. Uh, I finished it off with just a little bit of tuna on top and now we're ready for our taste test. This is really one of my favorite salads right here. That tanginess from the Dijon, but then you have it kind of rounded out with a little bit of the olive oil. And just, it's just so delicious. I think the garbanzo beans or the chickpeas are the perfect substitute for potatoes.
I love it. And it's just, like I said, it's, it's light, it's fresh, but yet it's, it's, it's substantial enough that you're not going to feel hungry after you've eaten it. Mm. Love it. All right, so that is pretty much it. If anybody has any questions, just go ahead and post them below. The nutritional facts, the full recipe, and pictures will be on my blog spot, which I'll post below. And until next time, enjoy. Bye.